Good morning. What is that mixture? High fives? High fives? High fives? High five to mix cereal. And we have some fun activities to do today. Is this a good lunch? Do you approve? Spaghetti. Some spaghetti, an apple, some yogurt. Do you need anything else? That's this. And now put that in there. <laughs> put put the bigger thing in there, Mom. We're off. That's better. Your backpack. I had a manual focus. You got, Where are you Abby, going? Abby, here. You have to come back and put your backpack on. And you have to give me a hug with this. Come here. Do you have a kiss? Thanks. I think you burped in my mouth. <laughs> Kids. <laughs> have a fantastic day, okay? I love you. Say, I love you too, Mom. Thanks for coffee. You're welcome. Got my local Lion coffee mug. I got one I'm wearing Boone. The puppers want to come inside. Come on, puppers. Oh, you didn't take the trash. Oh, shoot. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Your dog's chasing cats. Oh, and she's got her ball. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Jeez. Hey, can you throw me my keys? Oh. Right there. Thank you. Okay, I got everything. Let's go. No help in the world. We're gonna take my truck. Come on. You ever that feeling like like you like you don't belong? <laughs> Pulling up to Abby School. It was like Teslas and Q56. What is that? An Infinity or something like that? <laughs> in the drop off land. I'm in my old Toyota, the wheel bearing, squeaking obnoxiously, blasting tongue tied. You know that song, like, take me to your best friend's house. That song. <laughs> we have fun in the drop off line. Beat a bolt truck. We're cool. I like driving my truck. Priscilla's car is obviously way nicer, but you know, I just like driving my truck every once in a while. Especially when I take Abby to school. Something about like rolling the windows down is like blasting music. It's not like a, it's like a real truck. You know, it's a little Toyota, but it's still a truck. It's still my truck. I love it. This is my dad's. It has uh, 295,000 miles on it. I bought it off of him because um, he got a new truck. Before this one, I had a Chevy, the heavy Chevy. Silverado, like two-wheel drive, like it was just a beastly thing. Um, that one, that one I hit. Did I hit 400,000 on that? I might have. I'm done now. Are you ready? Yeah. Uh -oh. I have paperwork to do. Check it off my to-do list. Priscilla's been waiting on me. And now I'm busy. Isn't that how that always works? Yep. Look, my to-do list is empty though. That makes me happy. That's good. I mean that I part of it. I gotta add more stuff to it now. I have to do a boomerang real quick. You have to do a boomerang? That's on your to-do list? I use the app Tick Tick for like to-do lists and like goals and stuff. Just check it out. I like it. You guys want to see your boomerang? How'd it turn out? I don't like that one. <laughs> we always get a bunch of questions. Um, we always get a lot of new people. So we get a lot of a lot of questions about communication and how all that works and like like um, sign language versus using the iPad, things like that, right? And uh, you know which is better or sometimes we get people like why don't you teach her sign language uh she uses both and there's a there's a good reason why she uses both ab where are we going we're going to get a donut what are we going to take to get there abigail are we going on a car ride can you show me car no she's like that doesn't make sense that we're already in the car 
So when we were standing outside the car, she she said, where are we going? And she signed go. I said, going where? And she said, car. You know, she did the car sign. And then she said to get a donut because we were talking about Duncan. So um, it's important because her iPad's in her backpack right now. And she can communicate with us using her modified sign language. Um, oh, by the way, Abby's home from school. Uh, she can communicate with us using her modified sign language uh, because her iPad's in her backpack right now. You know, if it's not accessible or whatever, being able to communicate with parents, with caregivers in the future, uh, whatever it might be. The ultimate goal is the iPad because it communicates with everyone. Like, you would have to know what her signs mean in order to for her to communicate with you so the ipad is the tool that allows her to communicate with everybody that's why it's so important but we don't you know we still want to use her modified signs because it gives her another form of communication and ultimately that's the goal right to give her the power to communicate and and the ability to communicate um that's i mean that's been our goal since the beginning mm -hmm. So proud of you, kiddo. Hopefully that answers some questions. But she's doing great with it. Like, un lots of unprompted communication, you know, independent communication. Are you ready? She's so tired, you yeah. can tell. Her nose is stuffy, too. We're going to go? Yes, let's go. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> We're so excited. Are you excited for We're donut? We're so excited. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Abby is super congested. Every year when the weather changes, when it gets a little bit cooler, <laughs> I wonder if there's um if there's a specific I'm trying to fix my tripod at the same time I'm talking to you guys. Don't worry, I'm in the drive thru and be safe. I wonder if there's a specific pollen that gets her. You know what I mean? Yeah. And she doesn't know how to blow her nose. Fun fact. So that's Aww. a challenge. <laughs> <laughs> Poor thing. I know. It's like, but I'm so happy. So happy. Yeah, she doesn't know how to blow her nose. Like, try explaining that to somebody. Teaching somebody how to do that. Yeah. Like, hey, can you, can you uh, tell them? <laughs> Say, mobile order for Priscilla. <laughs> tell them that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> with excitement. <laughs> Explain to someone how to blow their nose. There's one thing. Here's another thing. Explain to someone why Duncan closed at 4 p.m. or whenever and we're driving away without the thing that she used her communication for. So adamant. That's frustrating. Like we've already, yeah, we already go, paid for it. We're gonna go to another one, okay? They don't have any donuts here. Okay, we found a we found a Duncan that was actually open. Um, mm. But bigger news, guys. Mm. New lids. They got new lids. We we asked the lady yeah. to drive through the like because because I assume the other place had just run out. Yeah. And uh, so they had some random lids or whatever. But I asked her, like, "Did you guys get new lids?" She's like, "Uh, yeah." I was, I was like, like, oh, good. They were, the other ones were terrible. She's like, oh, these are terrible, too. <laughs> I was like, oh, great. <laughs> I, I tell you what, though. The other coffee didn't leak. So. Yeah, it didn't. So far, so good. No leaks. So far, so good. These look, like, these look like Starbucks lids. This is the best ever, Sniffles. Oh, you can't <laughs> breathe. I can't breathe. Poor thing. Oh. Yeah, about the sniffing thing, <laughs> or about the blowing nose thing. I mean, think about it, right? Like, I got frustrated with Duncan earlier, so the Duncan being close, I didn't finish my train of thought. But think about it, like, it's an unnatural thing, blowing yeah. one's nose. It's natural to sniff. Oh, like, yeah. how do you teach that? It seems bizarre, Ooh. but... Kitty girl. Like, like, we have to teach her to, like, blow a horn or whatever we had to teach her to use a straw yeah remember dash taught her how to use a straw he did yes he he's so excited oh he'll never let me um live that down he's like you know i taught her how to use a straw 
How did he do that? I can't remember. He'll tell you the story, but hmm. yeah, he was the one. I did not know that. Yeah. Hey, did you see your new um, mask I got you, Abigail? Oh, Mom got you a new mask. Look, I got you one with tacos. I mean, if you gotta wear them, they might as well be cute, right? Look, it's got tacos on. Them. And then this you one. Like one? <laughs> Abby, what is this? <laughs> what does this one have on it? What are those? What are those? Do you see it? What is that? It's a donut. You're right. I do a little prompting, but. And those cute? Tacos and donuts, two of your favorite things. I think if anybody can pull that off, you can. Yep. Here, would you like Yeah, if I just. If I wore one with tacos and donuts, they would just look at me and be like, well, yeah, that makes sense. Do you want to carry your. Or you have your backpack to get? Yeah. She was on. It's kind of messed up though. She wears a taco mask. It, it looks cute. If I wear one, it just looks sad. <laughs> like I've given up all hope. It's so whatever, man. We're off to a good start on the Peloton this week, so. Yep. <laughs> come on, guys, outside. Come on. Come on. Here, come get this. Go outside, Maverick, outside. So if you guys have been here for a year or a little longer, we had this whole routine of that we were working on with Abby in her backpack, like getting her to unload it and stuff like that. And we had some issues with that. Um, a year later, in hindsight, we don't think it was like the routine or the asking her to do work or anything like that. It was just, you know, coming home, really. And we've kind of worked past that quite a bit. So it's been a lot easier. Um, but I don't think like the routine of doing her backpack is as important as it used to be. You know what I mean, Sil? Yeah. Like if she takes her lunch bag out down there, she does it down there. Well, no big deal. back here behind the camera smiling the whole time. That's so impressive. Right? I mean, how many times have we done that this year? So we haven't, the, the first time we did the actual ice box was last week, she and I. That's awesome. That's awesome, you know? It's just like, Consistency. sometimes you just get to a point where, you know, she's ready to learn something. Hey, did you wanna see these new things? Check yeah. these out. Look, we found these at the store for you the other day. We got activities later. We have rain toss. Doesn't that look cool? Those are like ropes instead of plastic rings, so that might be fun. And then we got ready, steady dough. Look at that. It's like Mr. Potato Head. Oh, you gonna sneeze? <coughs> yep, usually comes after the cough. Uh, we got ready, steady dough, Mr. Potato Head type. Play Isn't that cool? Do you like it? We'll try that later. Look, do you like We're these? We're gonna do this later, okay? Gonna break? All right. We'll have school break. Oh, no, I think she's saying, do you mean open? That's break. Pretzels. Listen, what what are you telling me to do? Nature Valley Bar. Well, this is 
What do you need with that? There you go. Open. Do you want to do this? Okay. Hey. Can you? Hey, look. Pick a color. Yellow? All right. It's your character. Look. <laughs> Here, hold. Here, hold him up. Show the vlog. You got him? Say, look, there's my guy. There's my guy. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. That was morbid, Abby. How do you do this? You just ripped him apart. Ready? Clean up. Nice job. Uh, it's a supervised activity. <laughs> What are you doing? Getting ready to cook. Cleaning up so it looks better on camera. I had it clean and then <laughs> y'all came in and like, Ugh! <laughs> Exploded. Abby, what Abby was real interested in the HelloFresh menus that are our recipes that Priscilla pulled out. Um, she's doing HelloFresh on her channel, so she switched it up a bit. She's like, you know what? I'll have Abby help. Yeah. One of uh one of Silla's favorite things to do is with her kids is cook. It is. So like, you know what, that'd be a cool thing because a couple of these ones, this is not sponsored, by the way. Just putting that out there. I mean, not on my channel, on hers is. Because this one is a 15 minute meal. Yeah. Ravioli, and this then the tacos 10. is 10. Yeah. Perfect. I know, for a busy night. Yep. Add that to your at home school <sighs> COVID <clears throat> repertoire. Yeah. You know what I mean? Abby, come Have here. Kids help you cook. It's time. I'm ready for you. Abby, you gonna help mama? Come on. Let's make dinner, Ab. Good job, ladies. Right? You did so good. Good job. Can I take your coat off? Here, stand up. Let me take your coat off. Oh, yeah, we gotta take our... Take your chef's coat off here. You did good with cooking, Ab. You're all done. It's fantastic. I'm so proud that you made my food. You made my... Your dad's dinner? <laughs> Do you need I mean, help? everybody's dinner, but... Do you need two hands? Oh. Are you helping me? <laughs> He's trying Abby's getting a nice hot shower to help clear out her sinuses. Thanks for dinner. You're welcome. Appreciate you. Of course. Thanks for doing dishes too. Huh? I got I got off scot free on that one. I'll take the trash out later, okay? Okay. And thank you guys for hanging out with us. We will see you tomorrow. Bye guys. Bye. You have a car behind you. Uh oh. Don't why why do I care if there's a car behind me? Because you were like not driving. You were doing... I was I was making sure I didn't hit the curb. I was because <laughs> it got a S turn through the parking lot and stuff. <laughs> Jeez. You said you have a car as I was pulling out into an intersection. It's not a cool thing to do. Now there's vlogging while driving. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>